Uh, the name of our organization is Living Hope. We're a Christian ministry and we serve in underserved or under-resourced communities around Cape Town as well as um, East London. We have a couple of departments. We've got the Family Strengthening Program, which is implementing the book sharing program. We have a recovery program. We have a hospice um, and agricultural program, and we have spiritual services as well as community-based nursing services. Uh, many of the communities that we are working with are characterized by poverty. Like with book sharing, we've decided to adopt it because we can actually see the impact it has in terms of giving the parent the kind of skill that will impact the child. Living Hope is our partner organization that is always, you know, seeking to train um, facilitators. Um, like this year, we train 10 facilitators because I feel like Mamsi Pumelele is one of the disadvantaged communities in terms of um, whether it's resources and parents who are facing a lot of unemployment. So they are not able to take their kids, you know, and pay for, you know, ECD or any learning program fees. We had the feedback from the parents. Some of them were very great stories. I remember other, other parents said uh, that um, their relationship has changed with their children since they started book sharing. With the, with the book sharing, you know what, it just changes a lot that the children, they are like other children. Seeing the, the impact it had, not just with, in the staff, but also in the, the parents as well as the children that have benefited from that, it's just been really a, a life-changing kind of thing.